With our abundant natural gas resource, Wyoming state government is increasingly exploring the use of natural gas powered vehicles. For light duty vehicles such as this pickup truck, compressed natural gas is a fuel of choice, replacing gasoline. The technology is not new, as nearly 15 million vehicles operate on compressed natural gas around the world. The U.S. does lag behind other countries, as there are only 112,000 vehicles in operation domestically. This Ford F-150 truck, operated by UW Extension, funded through a grant from Encana, is a bi-fuel vehicle, meaning it operates on both gasoline and natural gas. This prevents range anxiety, as there are currently only seven publicly available refueling stations in Wyoming. The conversion to natural gas was an aftermarket product, costing approximately $12,000 to install the tank located in the bed of the truck and the fuel delivery system. The high-pressure tank holds a gasoline gallon equivalent of 20 gallons of gas, giving a range of nearly 300 to 350 miles running exclusively on compressed natural gas. The economic viability of this system is currently being evaluated, but the price differential between natural gas and gasoline is the key. With over 90% of the natural gas used by this vehicle produced domestically, compared to a little over 50% of petroleum, energy security is a primary reason for using natural gas vehicles. With the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Milton Geiger, exploring the nature of Wyoming.